Well, have you ever wondered if you might have Jewish blood in your background? I am certain that many who love Israel do. Now, a breakthrough in DNA testing can help you find out for sure. For DNA researcher Donald Yates, digging around his family tree led him back to Europe and an era when Scotland was actually Jewish. Here's his fascinating interview. Uh, what brought you to, to the place of writing about uh, the Jewish uh, genealogy of Scotland? It's a fascinating subject. I can tell that you're uh, fascinated and almost speechless. I'm speechless. <laughs> Let, let's focus on <sighs> DNA testing because you have a DNA testing company. So we've been, I've talked to you quite a bit about this before the program because this is very intriguing to me. We get a lot of, uh, of uh, Christians that watch the program that want to know if it's possible that they're, they have Jewish blood somewhere. Sure. Well, they can find out. They can. Talk All about some of the breakthroughs. What is DNA testing and what are some of the recent breakthroughs? Well, DNA testing for your personal uh, information as a consumer or a hobby or, uh, began was an off-growth off, off of the uh, Human Genome Project. That was the most ambitious scientific undertaking in America since the Manhattan Project. Uh, I was trying to think of a way to connect nuclear w weapons with uh, DNA. Our last guest, <laughs> very clever. Uh, so I, I think you can connect them because with nucleotides <coughs> because there are three billion nucleotides in your DNA which is in the shape of a double helix and is found in every cell of your body. Don, okay, how does the DNA are. test work? Okay, it works with a swab, with um, something like a Q-tip. Okay. You rub it inside your mouth against the inside of your cheek for 30 seconds. You collect cheek cells that way. You put it back in the envelope, send it back to our lab, and we run the appropriate test. They're different tests. Well, so, but in essence, what, what, what are you doing in the test? The, uh, well, how, it depends and, and on how the does test. A per, and how is the person able to find out if, they're, if they have Jewish blood? Well, they get a report at the end of the process. And we have data on uh, many Jewish populations, Sephardic Jews, uh, from uh, Israel, Spanish Jews, Hungarian Ashkenazi Jews. Uh, but beyond that, there's a step that we take with uh, some newly discovered markers, and this is very exciting. Uh, this is where autosomal comes in, right? You remember that. I remember that term. Yes. Autosomal, the exciting thing about it is that uh, male or female can take it. It's the great equalizer. Females don't have a Y chromosome or they'd be a boy, okay? Uh, so uh, a male or a female can take it and it tests all of your ancestry, you all of your lines. Any degree of Jewish ancestry, it's going to give you a match to a Jewish population in the world. So pe people that are watching that want to find out if they have Jewish uh, genealogy can find out, is it 100% accurate? It's, it's completely reliable and it's uncanny. If you have one of our Ashkenazi Jewish markers, there are three of them in the panel that can be added to the test called the 18 marker ethnic panel. If you have one of those markers, you have Jewish ancestry. It's that simple. If you have a Native American marker, you have Native American ancestry to some degree. It does not tell you how much but it can be a very small or hidden amount. So if people watching want to find out definitively whether they have Jewish blood, they can do it now? Absolutely. With DNA testing and this new breakthrough, this That's autosomal, right. uh, it is male, female, it's a, it really is a new breakthrough. It is. In DNA it's testing. It's very exciting and uh, people generally find out that they're more mixed than, than they thought they might have been and there's at least one surprise uh, hopefully, 
it, it will be a pleasant one for you when you compare it well, <laughs> to, to, to your well, I'm gonna, paper I'm, I'm going to do it. I'm going to do it for my wife. Uh, Donald, that's fantastic. Thank you. When Scotland was Jewish, Thank you. Donald Yates.